thank you so much for always being available whenever I need someone to drive me around. You're a good man. Friends? Friends? <laughs> You don't have to, okay? Ogadari! 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 Agadari! Your food is ready.
just cheer up, Sharon. You've been acting up since Tony joined us in taking pictures. You know, I really don't get it. What is your problem with her? She's poor, dumb, and classless. Tell me, for goodness sake, she's your maid. Why are you so friendly with that girl? Because it wouldn't cost nothing to be nice to her. Or to anyone else. You should try it sometimes, you know. I just don't like that girl. That's your business. Let's see you some other time. Toyin, please let's go. Tired. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Tony, please, is there anything you would want? Uh, no, ma. I'm fine. Okay. We are leaving. Okay. Uh, that reminds me. Thank you so much for what you did for my daughter. <laughs> I really appreciate it. I have never seen her being so happy for a long time now. Yeah. God bless you. It's nothing, ma. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. It's okay. I, I had so much fun and I, I hope you did as well. Too. Yes, I did. I did. <laughs> Thank you so much. Especially for acknowledging me as your friend. Yeah. Of course you're my friend. I mean, we are both the same age and you've been of help countless times. So, on that note, I have this little gift for you. What's that? See it for yourself. Clothes? <laughs> wow. Yes, yes, yes. You are I, still doing more. It's nothing, ma. I, I saw how fascinated she was when we're taking pictures. I saw how she likes the dress, so just have to give it to you. And I added some clothes as well. Oh. Oh. Hey, thank you so much. God bless you. You're welcome. God bless you, my daughter. <laughs> I can't thank you enough. It's, it's okay, my Enough with the thank you. It's You're okay. such a wonderful thank person. Thank you, my. It's okay. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah? You're welcome. You're welcome. All right. We have to take our leave now. That's fine. See you tomorrow, dear. Sure. All, All right. right. Bye. Do take care, okay? All okay. right. Has a, a hat of gold. <laughs> what I don't understand is this. Ten your life is okay with me, but her friend, she's okay with it. Not her friend, she's not. And I wonder what her problem is with me. <laughs> My darling, the rich are always like that. They feel you're not their eyes. So why wasting their precious time with our, our kind? What is wrong with our kind? Huh? I mean, we are good people. We are very nice and kind. Yes, we might not have money, but at least we make the most out of the one we have. Huh? Of course, we are. Yes. Do they know about it? They don't. <laughs> well, it's <is> okay. <laughs> don't worry. I'm going to make money. Ah, and our family, I'll put them in a better place. And okay? you think I don't know? <laughs> <laughs> I know very well that my daughter is going to make me. Of course. You will change. I'll change our family. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you change our name. Yes. I know you will do that. Let me help you with the bag. Ah, my mom, there's also inside the bag. Ah, Chuka is here. <laughs> oh. I was wondering why. He's not here already. Two of you, I don't understand that. <laughs> <laughs> My Uber driver. Hey. Hey. Good evening, Mama. Good evening. Ah, how are you? Very fine, Mark. I am sorry I came a little late. 
It's okay. You don't even have to be. Mama, it's not be long. Mama finished. <laughs> Has it been today? My son, thank you so much. You are always a life server, you know. You're always welcome, Mama. Thank you. Young lady. What? Okay, man. Okay. Mama is giving me side to come inside. <laughs> She will never change. Wow, oh, hardly. Mm. African mother. <sighs> You've been smiling like you want to tell me something. I tell you what, I don't think so. So why the looks? What looks? <laughs> okay. I have no idea what you're talking about. Okay. But you know I can always get it out of you. Okay. Okay. See, my mother can just come out here at any time, or even my father, if you're getting out the medicine. Fair enough. So, what is it you want, you want to say? Um, okay, maybe I could just call and tell you on the phone. Why over the phone? Because... All right. No, I get it. I think it's something good. Okay. Uh -huh. It's something good, right? You find out. I'll find out. Mm. Let me go. We're talking back. Hmm? Well, I'll talk, I'll let you know. That was not five minutes. <laughs> God. But we will try to beat the time now. You yourself, you need to slow down. You need to slow down. Chuka is already like a member of this family. Eh? That you already even considers a son. Oh, ah. Your dad already considers him one. Well, I don't. Not until he has done the necessary things expected of a man who wants to get married to a woman. As far as I'm concerned, you are still single. And I am very much ready to give you out to any responsible man who comes to ask for your hand in marriage. Me, I will not be considering anybody. It's Chuka or no one else. So do you want to see it? Of course I want to see you wear it. So, are you going to wear it? Well, it depends on how bad you want to see it. I was thinking the occasion I told you about. Um, Zika's um, wedding. Yes. I want you to wear it to be the most 
shine and star there. I will only wait if you're going to be the only Prince Charming there. Sure, I will. <laughs> Please, oh. Um, I have to go and shower now, so I'll just relax. Mm? All right. All right, now, bye. Bye, babe. Who is that? Huh? Hey! Ah! Tony! Tony, Tony! Tony, Tony! Hi! See beauty? The friend in making. Hi! Abraham, good morning to you too. Uh, good morning. Hope you're fine. No, I was not fine. But immediately I saw you, I became fine. Oh, okay. Yes. No problem. My love. My doctor prescription. See, eh? If you're a drug, I'll take you over those. Purposely. <laughs> Good morning, ma. Good morning, Nora. You're welcome. Thank you. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, man. Do you? I'm fine, Nora. You're here to see your father. Yes, I am. And um, he didn't come back last night. Though he didn't go into details, but I guess it's because of work. Yeah, it's um, because of work. Okay. Yeah. Please uh, help me give um, this to him. Uh, mm. Okay, of course I will. All right. Let's come and see <laughs> Thank you. Um, okay. Oh, this one. They're here. Oh, really? Okay, that's fine then. I said I'm fine! But the doctor said... I don't care whatever the doctor said or any other person. I'm I don't sorry. care! I'm sorry, sir. I don't mean to hurt your feelings. Would you just rest, old man? Rest! Have some peace and quiet matter. Yes, sir. Can I have that? Yes, sir. Ah! Oh no! Oh no! Help! Are you dumb? Are you bad or something? Ah! How dare you? Excuse me. I came to drop your clothes. Here I go. Back to school. Tony, how could you do this? Why would you give the dress to that, that trash? Tony, you know I needed that dress. Sharon, you have a lot of dresses, so I don't get why you're complaining. Tony needs that dress more than you do. It doesn't change the fact that you put her feelings before mine. And that's quite upsetting. <laughs> Can you just stop acting like a child? Fine. What do you say we go shopping? I'll pay for everything you take. I promise. Teniola, I know you can do all this for me, but I really wanted that dress. Why would you give that dress to that, that trash? What were you thinking? Lunch is ready. Should I send the dining? Woman, why do you like asking silly questions? 
Can't you see we're having a conversation? Sharon. I'm sorry about that, man. It's okay. There's no problem. Don't bother yourself. I'll tell myself when I'm hungry. Teniola, why did you do that? Do you realize you just shut me up in the presence of your housemaid? Why? Nanny. She's my nanny. Another name for glorified maid. You will never change. I cannot change. You know, I still can't get my head off the fact that you gave my dress to that girl. I mean, I was this close to slapping that man. How can you be shouting at everybody as if they are kids? I even tried to use him up his shouting. I don't know, did I tell you to touch me? This is, this is that. It's very bad though, honestly. The way he treats people is very off. And it's something better than where he is. I would really, really... Well, he has to remember for now. He has been working for them for over 10 years. And I believe he can handle them more than you. I mean, it is not easy anywhere. You don't know what people have to endure to get a paycheck at the end of every month. It's not easy, I'm serious. Ah, but don't let it bother you, okay? It's bothering me. I'm sorry. Uh, let me take you home. Okay. Look, Tuka. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. 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 oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Butter! 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 Where are they? The ones upstairs are missing! Where are they? Chichi Chief. Don't you dare. It's like you don't know what I'm talking about. Say, where are they? I, I said, Chief, Chief asked me. Chief, Chief. Ah! Oh, no! Mata! Mata! Where are they? Where are they? Your father, Chief, asked me. Chief, Chief what? Chief, you, you, you work for me, yet you take instructions from me. Who does that? No but who does that? I, I thought I told you. No matter. I, 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 you told me. Yes. 
You told me, Oga. But even if Chief hadn't insisted, I would have, I would have also done it. Yes, I would have. These things are not good for you. Yes, they are not good for you. They are killing you but slowly. I, who the hell? Who the hell are you to make this decision for me? Now, who do you think you are to make this decision for me? Who gave you the right? Oh God. On her deathbed, your mother asked me to. Exactly. Exactly, Bata. My mother is late. And you are not her. And you will never be her. I'm sorry, please. So I'm very sorry. But uh, listen, you work for me, not the other way around. And if you're interested in working for my father, make your intentions known. I suggest, and I'll do something about it. Is that understood? Yes, sir. Mwata. What is wrong with you? Why are you crying? There's nothing. Don't tell me that. It's written all over you. Now tell me. Did anything happen to him? Did small guy say anything to you? Why would you allow that get to you? You know this is not his first time of acting out like that. Eh? Oh, go, go. It's, it's not as if it's spending me all. It's not what is making me hungry. Just that. Smaller guy is lost. Yes. He's lost. <laughs> and that we will not leave him. That is why we're here. Mata. Yes, he might be treating us wrong, but he needs us. You know that. Yes, I know. Um, he was even asking after you. He said he wants to see you. He did? Yes. It's okay. I'm going to see you. Leave me alone. Okay, I'll go okay. and get that. I'll go. Are you okay? Yes. I'm fine. I'm good. Are you sure you're fine? Yes. Are you sent for me? I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry, sir. Try that next time. And I'll shave your beards. I'm sorry, sir. Got the least of the body. I have it, sir. Buy everything on that list. Leave nothing out. Um, sir. I don't think there is any need for this because I've bought them already. You have? Yes, sir. <laughs> you have? Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, well then. You must know of matters lead to environmental exercise in my room. Yes, sir. 
you are the good bad guy. You went to buy all my stuff back, right? Yes, sir. I love you. Thank you, sir. You make heaven. Thank you, sir. No, what are these? What are these? Of course I know they are drinks, but these are not the type of drinks I want on my shelf. I'm sorry, sir. These are what you'll be needing for now according to the doctor's prescription for your relapse, sir. Who are you to tell me what I'll be needing and what I wouldn't need? Like you're some kind of family or something. I'm sorry, sir. Like I said earlier on ago, these are not the type of drinks I want on my shelf! I'm so sorry, sir. I know you will not appreciate this in any way. Neither do you matter nor I. You see, while we're still your ordinary employees, uh, you've come a long way in part of our family. And as your family, we can sit and watch you destroy yourself, sir. You are so smart, so brilliant, too passionate to destroy yourself, sir. I'm so sorry. I beg you, sir. Yes. He is right, sir. I'm sorry I crossed... I crossed my boundaries earlier. I'm very sorry. I was just worried about you. I was worried you would end up with this behavior and eventually hurt yourself so bad. Sir, please. I'm sorry. We are sorry. Yes, we are sorry. We are sorry, sir. I'm so sorry. Forgive us. Please, sir. We have sinned. Forgive us. Well, uh, you guys, professional, professional, badness. Sincerely, I will say you the truth. You are so professional. Yes. I run out of time. When he screamed at you, I thought you would have lost it. This kind of people, in a situation like this, all you need to do is to massage their ego. By that way, you calm them down. That is it. You have the key. That is the magic. <laughs> we did it. In fact, we'll repeat it again. <laughs> no. Let me go back. Go, 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 sir. Please, be sure to bring her back before dinner. You have my word. Good. Hey. So how do I look? Absolutely amazing. Thank you. I heard you talking to my mom, was she? Uh, yes, she just left. Thank you. Hey, God. Dika is very funny. Did you see? She said she wasn't going to cry, but did you see her face? She's something else. Uh -uh. Mm -hmm. But you ladies are always like that. Eh, uh, to our nature. I mean, it's not every day girl gets to leave her father's house. Like you do when your time comes to. Me? Cry for what? Ha! Somebody I know is ready to give me. Why am I crying? Really? Yes. <laughs> uh, okay, let's wait till then. No problem. So, what do I offer you? Water, drink, food? What do you want? Do you cook? I can get the food from anywhere. Well, I know what I want then, it's not food. Oh. 
We can't do this, Tony. Why? Because I promised your mother you'd be back before dinner. We can. And we will. My mother is not going to chew you raw. Like I want to chew you now. My husband, are you still here? But I told you they would come back soon. That was what you just said an hour ago. I wonder what that boy is doing with our daughter. Come on, my husband. They are adults. They can take care of themselves. Or their needs. See, Bisola, I don't understand why you are so calm about this tiny dead thing of your pain. Yes, I understand that she's of age. But marrying this cab driver of all people is what I don't understand. My husband. We have already promised her that we are not going to meddle in her personal affair. Fine. Let's just do that. Fine. I just hope he bring her back home tonight. I think I, I think I will call her. Please relax. <clears throat> That's what I'm sorry. Is it true, young man? Is that really what happened? Oh, yes, sir. That's what happened. And you expect me to believe that? Yes, sir. I'm sorry. your leave. Thank you, sir. Toy, my daughter. Well, I don't have much to tell you. Rather than to let you know that women are like flowers. So, that is all I want to tell you. You may go in. <clears throat> Bisola, why is it that I am the only one that is bothered about this whole thing? Why? My husband, what do you want me to say? Should we combine our mouths to talk to them? You have already spoken. You've said it all. I don't have anything to say anymore. Okay. Tell me. Why are you still here? Tell the party I've started ages ago. Tell me what are we still doing here? We are waiting for our Uber driver, Sharon. Tell me, you have the car. What do we need a Uber for? Can you stop nagging? You don't want to 
going to be at this party more than I do. So calm down. For three minutes long. Tell me, the Uber driver died on his way coming here. Sharon. Fine. Don't you listen to me? Must we end everything in argument? Mm. Uh, mm. Are you leaving? Mm. Mm. How are you? Mm. See, this mama is not like that. I am doing this for us. I want to end for this family. I know. Must you be dead before I realize that? My husband, please give yourself a break. Take care of your health. One week, two weeks, I mean. Then I think you should listen to mommy. In life, health comes before every other thing. Yes. Seems you both don't understand what I'm talking about. Like bows. I am like his hands, his legs. If I don't do that, nobody can. Then. Then someone else can do it. No one will be able to handle that job. I will. What? Dad, what is there? It's not just to drive him around and maybe run errands. My dear, it's more than that. Then let me handle it. Relax. Just listen to me and relax, please. Then I will put a call across and tell them about you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just call them. <laughs>
Chuka. Chuka, what are you thinking? the same thoughts this month. You've been awake all this while. Why don't we just get right to it? You scratch my back, I scratch Get your hands off me. No, no. Um, no, Chica, listen. Put it up, okay? I don't know the game you want to put up. But listen. It won't work. Chuka, no, there is no game. I am out of here, please. Chuka! Chuka! No, Mom. Mommy, I need you. Mother, good morning. Ah. <laughs> good morning. <laughs> good morning. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. You're not in school? No, no, no. You know, my dad is not feeling well. So, yeah, I came to fill in for him for a few days until he's fine. You drive? Yes, I drive. Wow. <laughs> yeah, good. thank you. Uh, you know, Ogugo is a very strong man. Yes. Yeah. Just like you said, there's the saying that every strong man needs rest. Sure. He definitely needs rest. Sure. Um, um, he's not ready to go anywhere. So I said, let me just come if there's anything I can help you do. <sighs> mm. <laughs> anything. Okay. Um. Can I help me chop the tomatoes? That's all. Oh, okay, sure. Yes. Thank you. All right. I was taking his medication. Of course, he is. He is. is this? Is someone actually living here? Oh, yes. What's wrong with you? You clumsy girl! I am not clumsy. You scared me. Well, it takes only an idiot to drop a tray of food. Where do you think this place is a refuse dump? It looks like one. Excuse me? What did you say? You heard me. You 
bigger balls. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Do you happen to have some light with you? Do you happen to know that smoking is not good for your health? Who the hell asks for your opinion? Who the hell are you? This is Tony, Ugo's daughter. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. She's Ugo's replacement for a few days. Leave us. What's going on here? What's going on here? Well, don't tell me that! Don't ask me such nonsense questions! You know, but my life! Let me live my life! This is my life! Thank you, God, 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 the gods! And may God bless you for giving me this life! Okay, but let me live it! But you are my son! How will I let you live it? You don't want my life! I run it for you! I am an adult! You are a child! I'm above it! You are a toddler! You are house. useless! This is my house! Your house? This is my house! You are a tenant here! Yeah. No! You tell me what you want! Tell me what you want because this is certainly not a life you want me. Well, you see, Bobs, you know I love you so much, right? I'm going to tell you exactly what I want. Oh, well, you see, I want to be left alone. Is that too much to ask? Huh? That is not happening. That is not happening. You have been given the freedom time and time again, and you are not using it. You make drugs, alcohol, your companion, and women, your stress reliever. I'm done with this. I'm done. Look at you. You are slowly sleeping away. No, 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 not at all, Father. See, I. You stop. Come on, stop. See, Dad, Pops. I'm fine. I'm fine, yeah. I'm, I'm fine. You know that you're not fine. Now, when was the last time you ever looked at yourself in the mirror? Huh? When? Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, fine, fine. You win. You win, Dad. I am an addict. All right? I get high on these drugs and I use the women as a stress reliever. You win. That's what I do. That's who I am. Okay. But that is not the son I give birth to. Why are you so different from your siblings? Father, I am sorry for messing things up for you. I am sorry that I'm really things for you. But don't you dare! Don't you dare compare me with them. Because you don't know how I have managed to be here today. Drugs. Alcohol, women. What else is new? Look, young man. What I think is that it is time for you to go back to rehab. There is no way that will ever happen. No way in hell that is happening. you see from afar is 
So what happens to those two? Whatever happens, it can't be as well as the last one. Well, I've not been here for long, but I've heard about situations like this. But I hope this is not the part where I have to hide if it gets worse. <laughs> it hasn't gotten to that. You sure? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, you know what? Relax. Right? No, 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 no. You, you don't have to clean. I'll do it. Allow me to do it, okay? Really? Of course. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Come in and we'll get you something. All right, let's go. I have never seen such an insensitive, immature, unreasonable sports brat. I mean, you have everything on a platter of gold. Why destroy your life like that? Hmm. Now that I have heard about this, I don't think I would ever want to meet him. If you think he's that bad, he has a furniture company and he has grown from grass to grace. He isn't that bad. My point is, why is he always bitter and angry at everybody like they ruined his life? Mom, do you know today the father was talking to him and he had the nerves to walk out from his dad? Who does that? Yeah. He has his own demon, which he's trying to fight for. Like I said, that boy isn't that boy bad. He's a smart boy. Mm -hmm. You should better be careful of those demons because they will destroy him if he's not careful. Sorry, I had to get to Claire's face before coming. Where is the king of the jungle? Booga Booga. Where is he? Huh? You're staring. Why are you staring? Mm. Well, Booga Booga is here. I, I didn't know you would be up this early. Did everybody do that? This is my house. And I can get up whenever I want. Of course, you can. The bastard had a lot of clothes to wear, but now he decides to wear this one. You're late. You asked me to go get the laundry. And it took you the whole day to get here? Huh? Does your father know you're the sloppy at work? Excuse me. You heard me. You Yeah, hello? Yeah, William's here. Oh, 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 yes, I'll be there. It's okay. Do what you have to do. Let's go. What about the laundry? Um, don't worry, I'll take it inside. Come on, let's go! For crying out loud, it bats is faster than you.
here. Where's my friend Westerny? Uh, uh, please, I just greeted you. Good morning. And what if I decide not to answer you? Sorry, please. Tell me he's in her room. Yes, she is. Almighty Miss Dakori. Girl, what's wrong with you? I have been calling and testing you. Why haven't you been responding to me? You know you have a phone for a reason, yeah? Can you at least look at me and just talk to me? What's wrong? Why are you looking like this? I left you and see how beautifully hopeful you're looking. What's wrong, Tenny? Come and talk to me. What happened? Tenny. What's wrong? He's fine. Sure? Yes, I'm sure. He's in the best times. He has been his doctor for years, so he knows what he needs. Okay. Mata. Ah, I chief. Came as fast as I could. Yeah, he, he's in his room with Dr. Andrew. <sighs> so you. Yeah. You have to start going, okay? Mm -hmm. I will keep you posted. Okay, no, no problem. Let me just grab my bags. So okay, yeah, all right, thank you. all right. Jesus. <laughs> okay, Martha, thank you, thank you. Sure, I'll tell him. All right, now, bye. Is he okay now? Yes, sir. How did you find where I live? Are you stuck in me? I want us to talk. Oh, you do? And uh, you chose to be here. So tell me, how important is this thing you want us to talk about that you had to come to my place? I love you so much. That is why I did what I did the last time we met. I love you. Tenny. 
you are. You're a nice person, no doubt. You have a good heart. You are beautiful, you are... You are respectful. But... I have a girlfriend. And I want to marry her. I love her so much. What environment is this? Yes, this is where he lives, where he calls home. Dad, I hope we're not going to be robbed here. No, 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 no. I understand this is not the kind of environment you're used to. But this is where Ugo and his family lives. Okay, Back. Keep... Yes. Where? Yeah. This is... Pull over here. Yes, yes, yes. That, that's where he lives. Good. Okay. Let's go. But what's wrong? Sorry, Dad, I can't go in there. I, I have disappointed... Um, I've disappointed him more than I've disappointed you. But... I, I can't face him. But you promised. That I do what I promised. Okay? Look at me. I don't look like a person. I can't let him see me like this. It's going to break him. So, Dad, I'm going to be here while you go in there. I'll wait for you here. Okay. But don't go anywhere. I would. I'll stay put. Toyin, I just want to say thank you for saving my son's life. That was why we came. What he said, he couldn't face you. But I just want to say thank you for saving him, Toyin. You see, had you been a minute late, he might not have survived it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Sides, okay. I, I believe anyone in my position would have done exactly the same thing. Not everybody. You were just exceptional. Sir, is it going to be okay? Right? Yes, it's going to be okay. He has agreed to go back to where. And he's leaving tomorrow. Sir. Um, the problem is not going to real. He always waits and goes back. Yes, but what can I do? But hope that he pulls it off this time.
Don't you feel lonely in here? So? So come down and take a walk. Where to? Just walk. Just walk? Mm -hmm. It's a nice environment, so we'll just walk. Come down. Come down, stop being scared. I know a neighborhood is not exactly as the one you have up there, but it's a very nice place. The people here are nice and everybody is happy. You know, I've been wondering. Wondering what? You see, you are the very first person that's, I mean, the only one or the very first person that has stood up to me. Don't back it down. Uh, well, I'm sorry if I make you feel that way. It's just who I am. I see. Who you are. <laughs> yeah. So I hear you're going to rehab. I'm going to say to me, yes, yes, but as a matter of fact, between you and I, that is a waste of time, a waste of resources. We stop everything because that shit never works. It never works or you never allow to work. Are you the problem? No. Oh. I mean, in life, everything starts from you. Just like the doctor and the patient. Yes, it's the doctor's job to save a life, but it also depends on the patient. Are you ready to fight to live? Everything is about you making a choice and taking a decision and sticking to it. Yes. Stop going to rehab because you want to impress the people around you. Do it for you. Do it because you want to, because you need it. Yes. If you don't do this, then nobody is going to do it for you except you. You alone can be good for you. You can do better, I think. Well, I think we need to help that. Okay. Um. So don't you like the neighborhood? Hmm? <laughs> they don't rob people here. Yes. Have you gotten it? Hi. What? Thank you. You haven't? But I'm done with the transaction. Oh, I think um, it's bad network. You will soon get it, okay? Yes, that's what I'm saying. Okay. You will. I will call you back. My baby, what is it? Um, nothing, Mom. I'm fine. I insist. Tell me, 
What is it? Tell me. Talk to me. There is someone I care about. But he is not reciprocating. And who could that person be that is not reciprocating? Come on! That will be over my dead body. What is it? Why, Mom? What do you mean, why? Why, Mom? Because he is a cab driver? Oh, yes, then you're right. He is a cab driver. Everything is wrong with it. What do you want? I'm asking you. How do you want people to start addressing you and I? Oh, wait. Mrs. Seniola cab driver. Then me. Mother-in-law to a cab driver. Come on, that's preposterous. You are not the one getting married to him. So why are you worried? Sit down. Let me make it clear to you. Now sit. I am worried because you are the child of my womb. Look away when I'm talking to you. Look at me. Teniola, I want what's best for you. What do you want with this driver? Your father and I were able to acquire all this because of connections. Now tell me, sweetheart, what connection does this taxi driver have? In case you fall into danger, how can he help? I'm asking you, I give back to you for you to be higher than us. And you are trying to reduce yourself. Now you want me to sit back and last fold my hands and watch you ruin your life. All in the name of the stupid thing you call L.O.V. in love. No. I ask you, what does that make me? A good mother or a bad mother? It makes you a mother who hasn't been present in her daughter's life. I beg your pardon. What do you mean by that? Teniola, I have been here and there just to put food on your table. Just to make you look like a golden child that you look now. I never asked you for any of this. I never. All I want is for you to be present in my life. If you love me, you would support me. Are you walking out on me, Teniola? Yes, Miracle. I just made a payment to our talking share supplier. Yeah, so soon you will get confirmation of the payment and some other details of, you know, shipments that we make. I'm sure you know what to do. Yes, there. Yes, no problem. Oh, no, 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 no. No, I will soon be there. I will soon be there. All I need you to do for me is call up one, so and give him the heads, that's all. It's all right, eh? All right. Good afternoon, ma'am. Bless you, sweetheart. Sharon! <laughs> How are you? I'm fine, ma'am. Oh, please, sit. <sighs> I'm so glad to see you. Same here, sweetheart. How are you? I'm fine, ma'am. You know, Tiny told me that you were in town, but I doubted it, but obviously she was right. Well, <laughs> I've been at home for some time now. Just that, um... Your friend is not in her right place at the moment. Come, what have you been eating? You're all grown, <laughs> madame. 
<laughs> Thank you. And you look so fabulous, ma'am. Oops. Merci beaucoup. <laughs> so, tell me, how is Izu and Angela? They're fine. Mom and Dad, they're doing great. That's nice. So are the others. Mom, don't tell me you came empty-handed. Please don't tell me so. Like I could have, even if I wanted to. <laughs> you seem to have forgotten who I gave birth to. Speaking of her, where is she? In her room. <laughs> okay. Well, um, she's been all moody. She's not happy. Can you do me a favor? Just take your friend out. Go to somewhere nice. You know, let her have fun. And call off for a while. Um, why? Is something going on? Well, not really. You know how it gets around here whenever I'm around. <laughs> Are you not going to do that for me? Of course I will. <laughs> and I promise you, when she returns, her mood will be way better. Thank you. Let me see my friend. Yeah. <laughs> You're really big now. I'm not big. <laughs> You're kidding me. Tony, you're freaking kidding me. He's a cab driver. I know that. And frankly, I don't see how that's anyone's business. Tony Ola, he's not good for you. And I'm sure you don't need anyone to tell you this. You know what I don't need? Someone trying to act all high and mighty like they care. But they don't. You don't care. So quit with the lecture. woman what is this you were supposed to know you are supposed to reach out to me and tell me what the hell is going on with my daughter that's a part of your job description remember um, I am sorry madam but you know kids of this day it's not everything I like to share of course I know which was why I hired you. You are a mother. A mother of three. And you have been her nanny for God knows how long. Yet, you do not know nothing about her. How can it be? You know what's worse? That this whole thing happened right under your nose. Yet, you know nothing about it. Now tell me, what do you know? A cab driver. Of all people? That's bullshit! Um, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, madam, but if I may ask, what is wrong with a cab driver? Is it not her happiness that is more important here? What stupid happiness can one get with her money? I'm asking you! Everything does not revolve around the stupid sentiment and cheap emotion you call love. Now I'm going to make it clear to you once and for all. I care about the future than the now. And as a mother, I know what's good for my daughter. That man is no way good enough for my daughter. <laughs> Well, madam, my daughter is dating a cab driver. And um, as long as she's happy, it is enough for me. Oh, that's good for you. Why am I not surprised? You have always lived a life of struggle, that's it. Now look at me. I care about my daughter. That man is not good enough for my daughter. I do not want to disrespect you because of your age. You are pushing me. Now leave my presence at once. Thank you, madam. Stop. 
What are you doing there? What were you doing with Toy? Why are you with Toy? Answer me! Chuka, don't, don't, don't tell me Toy is the girl you, you're seeing. Of course she is. No. No, 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 no. That, that's not possible, Chuka. That is not possible. You, you cannot be with Toy. No! You should be with me, not her. I love her. No! Chuka, you don't love her. You, you should love me. No, it's me. You should love me. Now. You should love me. How can you, how can you love her now? No. I left Chuka, the house. Can you I please left, calm left. down? No. You, I left everywhere. I left the house. I left everywhere. Just to come to you and you, you're telling me you love her. No. Chuka, can you just calm down? You, you're creating a scene. No, I, I don't care, Chuka. You, you have to love me. You have to love me. You have to love me, Chuka. You have Stop to this. love me. No, Stop I this. don't care. You you cannot love, you don't know what you uh, want, okay? You hey, don't know what you, I know what you don't I know want. you love me, you don't know it yet. You know, you don't know it, you're just blinded, okay? Sharon, this can be right. I mean, she cannot just leave you like that and disappear without answering her calls because I've been calling her. Look at the time. Um, I'm I'm sure she'll be back home soon. Mrs. Dakori, you need to calm down. Calm down? Oh, do not tell me to calm down! For crying out loud, my daughter could be kidnapped. And you know how part of this world is. No good security. And you are telling me to calm down. How can I? What's that? Hold on, please. And that's why I said to bring you here. This is me behaving myself. I won't leave this car. You just have to come. What the hell is wrong with you, Teniola? I'm asking you. Now, where have you been? I have been calling you and you refuse to answer me. What is wrong with you? Why are you acting like you care? Answer me. Why do you pretend like you care? Hey, young lady! I am not going to take that tone with you. Now, if you want to get angry, you get angry. If you want to die, all right. I didn't say that, but all I'm trying to let you know is there is no way I'm going to let you marry that pauper. Tony, you heard that? Hey, and you must be who? Obviously, the cab guy she has been dying for. Senora, what? I cannot believe you kept the secret away from me. Your best friend. I kept it because it is none of your business. Mind your business. Chuka. Chuka. I hate you. Come back here, Senora. I hate you. Come back here, you. Just hold on, all right? Peniola!
can't stop it, Sharon. Stop it! You have completely and finally gone out of your mind. What is wrong with you? So you knew all along this daughter of mine that that boy has someone else in his life. Yet you lost for him. It is not lost, mom. So what is it? I love him. I love him and he loves me too. Oh no. He doesn't love you. He's in love with some other person. He's in love with your nanny's daughter. Damn it. That's bullshit. And you know what? They are getting married. No. He won't, mom. He won't. He, he doesn't know what he wants, mommy. He doesn't. I, I know what's best for him. I, I know what's best for Chuka, mom. You know? Yes. Yes. You know? Yes, mom. Yes, I do. How? I know because I love him. I love him so much. I would love him way more than that bitch. Oh, shut up. He doesn't love you. He's in love with some other person. Can't you get it? No. No, mommy. Shut up. He's in love. With some other person. He is happy when he is. No. Mommy, no. Mommy, 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 please. Mommy, please. Mommy, talk to him. Okay, not help me talk to Chuka, please. He will listen to you, mom. Please. Mommy, please, yes, talk to him. Talk, 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 talk to Chuka. Mommy, yes, mommy, love? please talk to him. Please. Mommy, please, I beg you, talk to him, mommy. Mommy, talk to him. Mommy, mommy, please. Please, mom. If you don't talk to me, I'll die. I'll kill myself, mommy. I'll kill myself. I'll kill myself. Mommy, I'll kill myself. Please. Please talk to him, mommy. Mommy, promise me you'll talk to him. Promise me you'll talk to him. Mommy, promise me. Talk to him, mommy. Talk to him, mommy. Talk to him, mommy. Please talk to him. Good evening, madam. Madam, are you okay? I should be fine. Just do me a favor. Go call my daughter. She has been having rough days lately. It's okay, madam. to lose. You've got lots to achieve. You can have whatever you want. Name any amount. I can have your mother flown abroad for that medical she wants. I can get you a position at Tennis Father's company. All you have to do for me is please Save my daughter's life. Her life is in your hands. Please.
Jessica, why are you pissing me? You're scaring me. I don't know you're supposed to be doing all this, don't you? You think I'm not? Of course I am. How did this even happen? What kind of a question is that? I am sorry, it's just that I am... I am confused. I don't know what to do. This wasn't how I envisaged today to go. A lot. And I am still trying to figure all of this out. Bisola, your services are no longer needed. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry we have to let you go. Madam, what did I do? What did I do wrong? Please. No, you don't have to do this. What is my crime? You did absolutely nothing, Bisola, believe me. Please. Just that, um... My daughter will be getting married soon and uh, she will also be traveling with her husband. Bisola, you know me too well. I'm not always around. I'm always, you know, there, here, and uh, that's it, so. Wow. That's it. So our daughter is getting married? Yes. My goodness, this is good news. I'm so happy. You know what? She really deserves this. Thank you. She deserves it. Thank you she so much. She needs to be happy. Yes. Honestly. Honestly, I'm, I'm, I'm more than happy over this news. <laughs> I will transfer your money. So soon you will get an alert of your salary. <sighs> it's okay, madam. Thank you very much. It's nice working with you. All these years. I'm so happy. Even though I am being discharged, it is of good. It is because of good fortune. So I'm happy. I'm really so happy. I thank God for you. And please try and take good care of her and the husband. Oh, please. My greetings to her. She will hear. <laughs> oh, God. Chuka. <laughs> Chuka, where have you been now? Chuka. Yeah. I've been looking for you for the past three. I'm talking to you now. Eh? You even quit your job. You went to my job place? Yes, now. I was looking for you. I was very worried when they said you stopped working. Huh? What? What's going on? I have a lot going on in my head, okay? I have so many things going on in my head. Oh yeah, wait now. Just tell me, what, what's going on? We're talking about the pregnancy. Yes. What should we do? I don't know. The body is yours. You're the one carrying the pregnancy and whatever you decide, fine. I know the body is mine. But we did this thing together. We made this life together, Truka. Let's decide together. Hmm? Let's get married. Get rid of it. What? Chuka. Chuka, wait so now. What is it now? Eh? You want me to get rid of the baby? Eh, Chuka? I thought you wanted us to get married. Don't you want to get rid of it? <sighs> Chuka, wait. Answer me first. I should get rid of this baby. 
You said we'll get married. Listen to me. I have thought of it. It won't work. Okay? It won't work. You deserve better. You deserve a man that will treasure you. A man that will worship the ground you walk on. A man that will adore you. Huh. But I am certainly not that man. Shuka, who told you that? And what's going on with you? What is this now? Achuka, all these things you've mentioned, you are that man now. No, 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 no. I am not. Achuka, what are you saying? I am not. I am sorry about that. Achuka, oh, wait now. Ah, ah, Jesus, what is going on? Achuka, oh, wait now. Where are you going to? What is it? Achuka, I think I'm pregnant and you're just going like that. For the past three weeks, I've not even seen you. Nothing, nothing. And you're saying these things like this. Can you please leave me? Achuka, oh, please tell me what's going on now. It's me or oh, it's not you. Achuka. Chuka, tell me now. Look at me. Chuka, please just tell me what is going on. Okay, fine. Fine. Hey, what's going on? What's wrong? Nothing is going on, actually, but... I'm sorry, okay? What are you sorry for? What happened? I'm sorry for everything. I... Just that I have a lot going on in my head. Get your slippers. Chuka, leave the slippers first and talk just to me now. Just get your slippers, please. Okay. okay. Listen, Tony. I have a lot going on in my head. Okay? And I really do not want us to stand here talking about this. Can you go? You know you can tell me anything. Did you, you, did you mistakenly kill somebody? What is going on? Listen, I wouldn't want people to come out and, and, and when they see us, they look somehow. Okay. So we're not supposed to be talking about this here. But you can what happened yes. now? Oh, nothing happened. That is what I'm saying. I, I, I took it. Jesus. Chuka, where are you running to? Chuka, where are you running now? Chuka! 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 Chuka, wait now. Chuka, where are you running now? Chuka, where are you running to? Hey, Chuka, I'm pregnant now, Chuka! 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 That boy, Chuka. I knew it. I knew he would do something like that. I knew it. But how could he do that to my daughter? How dare him? Calm down. Calm down? Bisola, you tell me to calm down. Have you seen the condition of your daughter? Have you seen her? She neither eat nor drink water for days. Now. And that idiot is nowhere to be found. You are asking me to calm down. I can't believe this. I can't believe he did this to my daughter. I kept saying it. I kept saying it, but you, you always see the good in people. Huh? Now see where he has landed us. The same idiot has got missing and your daughter is out there trying to kill herself. Men. No wonder they say some men has come. This boy is the highest come I have ever seen on earth. To hell with him. Is he not ordinary uh, uh, taxi driver? Ah! Taxi driver car. Look at this. Did you know? Is that why you stopped going to their house to walk? Why didn't you tell me? Because I didn't know. <laughs> Please come and sit down. I 
I told you she woke up one morning and fired me. So this is why. Chuka is marrying her daughter. How could she? I mean, how could they do this to us? How could they do this? Because we don't have? They, 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 they can never get away with this. What? Join! Join, what is it? What? What is wrong with you? Your stomach is turning you. Uh, wait. So you what is it? I want to throw up. As if you want to. Mm. Uh. So you. So you. Uh. Are you? Are you pregnant? I'm asking you. Are you pregnant? Hey, Toyin! I said... Hey! Oh! Oh! Sorry for disappointing you. <laughs> you can punish me all you want. You can do anything you want to me. But please forgive me. I'm so scared. I don't even know how I'm going to tell Daddy. <laughs> oh, please, I'm sorry. Where are you coming from? 
Where are you coming from? Your mother has told me everything to him. How dare you got pregnant out of wedlock? Huh? You're sorry. You're sorry. Okay, wait for me. No, 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 please, please, don't do Let this. Her. Don't do this. I'm begging you, please. Allow me to kill her. No, 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 no. Your only daughter, please. It's better I kill her than bring her self to this family. Please. Please. Allow me to kill her. Please. It's not you. This is not you, sir. With all due respect, sir, I know you are angry. And you have every right to be angry. Yes, you do. But as a matter of fact, I don't know what this is all about. But if we don't control this right now, devils and people will be running into this compound to know what the problem is. So, a wise man once told me that there are multiple ways to handle an issue. And the wise man is standing right before me. So, you are going contrary to what you taught me. She go, I don't see her around. Well, she's at my father's. I just got back today. And I also. And also, I'm going to try and leave it alone to see how it feels. But first things first, we need to get you patched up. Let me call the doctor. I don't need a doctor. I just want to have my bath and rest. Then think of how I'm going to face my parents, especially my mother. Well, everything you've said here, you're correct. Except for the last part. Thinking to no no. Okay? We still have to go to the doctor. I have to get you cleaned up, okay? Supplies. I went to know now I'm back. You wanna go see them? I'll see them later. I need some fresh air. You keep saying that. You say that a lot. Need some fresh air. How do you mean? You know, even the baby in your stomach will testify that your ex was a bastard. Excuse me. Come on, you heard me right. 
to you. For crying out loud, you heard me right. Come to think of it, a man who claimed to love you chooses wealth, prestige over you. That ex of yours is an opportunist. Come on, do you? Who does that? He may have his reasons. Reasons? Can I talk to you for a minute? Yes. Please. Reasons, don't you? No, what reasons are you talking about? Come on, talk to me. What reasons are you talking about, Tonya? Since you think you know him that well. See? You can't think of any because there is none. So stop trying to fish out excuses in his stead. Tonya. See? That was what I was doing back then. Are you listening? I was struggling so hard to find excuses for the type of life I was living back then. I was dying inside of me. But still struggling to find reasons and excuses why I was doing what I was doing. Back then in school, I joined some kids. It was fun hanging out, no doubt. But I got addicted to the things I was introduced to. Are you talking about the drugs? Yeah. The drugs. The women. The parties. The women. All of it. You see, there was no reason for me to turn out the way I did. Because I grew up with my parents around and uh, with so much love in the air and what have you. But look at those kids in the neighborhoods, poor neighborhoods. Some, if not most of them, were raised without their parents being around. But it turned out okay. Yeah? So you see, Toy. I have no reason to turn out the way I did. Right. <sighs> you need to start thinking about yourself. Your baby needs you, not a part of you, but the whole you. You need to obey the first law of survival, me first. Think about yourself. Can you do that? What is it? Oh my baby! Oh my god! What do you, what, what do you mean by? 
What do I do now? What do we do? 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 Oh, Dad. Oh, come on in. Toye, your parents are here. Please come in. You're welcome. Please. It's all right. It's all right. Absolutely okay. Let's talk about it now. He's out. Yes, you're right. We spent all. We spent all that we had. All our savings just for my sake. We don't have any more money to spend. It's an expensive surgery. All I wanted is to walk you down the eye. I couldn't do that. I couldn't do that. It's okay. I'm sorry, Tony. Oh yes, Tori. You would. Because I'm going to make a read beds to have your father float abroad for the best medical care. Oh yes. Are these dreams of walking you down the aisle a reality? So you choose before or after the surgery, I'll wait. I don't understand. What do you mean? Toya. Let's get married. And fulfill your dad's dream of walking his only daughter down the aisle. What are you saying? I was coming to your house with high hopes. Be it fate or hope, I was praying to get you on time. To beat you on time. Um, then, I... Um, I understand that this um, All this time I've been with you has been very helpful. You feel a sense of pity to me. No, 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 no
This has nothing to do with PT, Toye. It's nothing to do with PT. This right here is love. Yes, Toye. I am irrevocably in love with you. And nothing will give me so much joy than to make you my wife. To have you as my wife. Sometimes the most beautiful things of life comes out of the most ugly ones. Likewise, the most beautiful experience of love. It felt just like yesterday that I was caught in that hell, betrayed by the one I love and the one I call friend, and lost the only reason I could have held on to life for. I could totally see my life was over then and it was briefly because from the bees came out the most sweetest thing the earth has ever tasted. Life never goes as planned no matter how much we want it to. It is filled with lots of bricks and stones and debris but that is life. My husband always asked me, do you think it was fit? I've never given him any answer. Maybe one day I will. Because honestly, there is the most perfect man I have ever seen. Dara and I had it rough during the first time because of obvious reasons. My mother believed that once an addict, always an addict. But in my two years of marriage, he has kept on proving her wrong. But even if he were to prove her right, I am here to support him because he's done the same for me and he's been patient too. He had asked me, what if I run into Chuka again? What happened? Frankly, I don't know. But I know that I have forgiven him and I want to believe that he's happy with the decision he made because I am, because Darren is my destiny. I didn't sign up for any of this, Sharon. I don't want this. I thought I loved Chuka, but I don't. You did when you had him leave his pregnant girlfriend for you. All I wanted was to be happy with the man I love. And Chuka clearly isn't that man. And you didn't care who gets out or scared for life, as long as you got what you wanted. I get it. What I did was wrong. But I don't need you telling me any of that. I just want to know what to do. Ask for a divorce. A divorce? Yes. I need to get a divorce. So your mother loved me on this one. Don't get me wrong, Chuka. I really thought I loved you. But clearly I don't. I was only really lacking love then. And you were the only one who showed me so much care. And I mistook it for love. In the midst of my confusion, I had to consult several therapists. And they told me it's infatuation. Tony, I, I heard you talk about divorce. Do you want a divorce? Yes. Wait. So I have been wasting my time 
What would this work? Oh, please, Chuka. Uh, you and I know you want a divorce as well. So this is why you have been acting up. Even while we were in Europe. So this is it. This is it, right? <laughs> Can you just cut it? Cut it already! Why do you keep pretending? Why do you act like you love me when you don't? You and I know that you are here because of what my mother offered you. Or do you love me? Are you kidding? Oh, Tenny, you're driving me nuts. Tenny, you're getting me crazy right now. What are you saying? Listen, it is high time you got back to your senses Else I will make you. Lay your hands on me again, Chuka. And I will make sure you rot in jail. Wait. You know what? Take your things. Pack all your belongings and leave this house. I am done. This marriage is over. So I left everything. That is what you want to tell me, right? I left everything to be here and... You left nothing. You are only here because of money. Money, you are greedy. Yes. Tony, we are in this together. Never. Never you are leaving this house, Chuka. I, I need house. my peace. I am done. I am not leaving this house. You are leaving this house. You are leaving this house, Chuka. I am going no. I am done. You are not Done. I am done with this marriage. You are not I done. I am done. Because you don't know what you I want. know what I want. I know what I want, I I want now. Tell me you don't know. You know what, what I want now, Chuka. I am done. Philip! Philip! You are leaving this house. I am going to take breakfast. all your things out of this house. You need to get your things out of this house. You are leaving this house. this one. Then answer him. Okay. Hello? Hi, son. It's a boy! <laughs> oh, sorry. Boys, actually. <laughs> Ibeji! Ibeji! I heard it. Twins! Two boys! Oh my goodness! Uh, <laughs> please, can we talk to them? Oh my goodness! Please, can we talk to her? Uh, yes, yeah, sure, sure. I'll put her on. Okay, okay, okay. Hey, babe. Mama, dad wants to talk. My darling! Oh, Yabeji, 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 Yabeji! Oh my goodness! Oh, I'm, I'm so happy. My daughter, how are you doing? Mom, Dad. Oh my goodness! I hope you are feeling fine. Tired, in pain, but it's bearable. Oh, I'm sorry. That's how it is for every mother. Yes. Oh, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. At least Derek can take good care of you. My son, is that not true? Yeah, what else am I here for? <laughs> Congratulations, my daughter. How are the kids feeling? Oh my no, goodness. Yeah, they are still in the nursery. The doctors are still making sure they are very okay. Oh my goodness. God has finally <sighs> done it. He has put my enemies to shame. <laughs> oh my God. God has done it. I can't believe I'm a father! Oh my goodness, I'm a grandmother. <laughs> my husband is a grandfather now. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. This is your big dog. You've forgotten that. I'm, I'm so, so fine. sorry. I'm sorry. Hi. <laughs> I'm so happy. Oh. I'm so happy. 
We are grandmother. I am glad grandmother. to see this day. Grandmother, grandfather. Honestly, I can leave this world now. And if I would do that with no regrets. You have started again. I don't just like it. How can you bring up a date in the middle of happiness? It's not good now. Don't spoil my good mood though. Let me tell you, you are not going anywhere. Your grandchildren have just arrived into this world. And you will live to see them with your eyes. Carry them, celebrate them. Even celebrate your great grandchildren. Because that is the promises of God upon you and I. We live to celebrate, oh. You're right. Hey, you. You're right. Talk of that. I can be grateful enough to God Almighty for witnessing this day. God, I'm grateful. So happy. I'm what grateful. are we going to use to celebrate? What am I going to cook for us to use to celebrate this day? This I, I, I don't know. What do you want? I, let, let me go. Hi. What you see from afar is always different on close range. A bird that is more precious. Because